I'm Dave Cravassier. Right now on your 13 Action News Update, Valley students could be back in the classroom by January. School district leaders will be presenting a hybrid learning plan to the Board of Trustees Thursday. Plans include some students returning to the classroom as soon as January 4th and all returning by January 11th. Parents will still have the option to keep their child in full-time distance learning if they choose. A CCSD board meeting gets underway at 5 p.m. Thursday. CSN is helping people get back to work. A new career hub will be unveiled at the Charleston campus today. The hub will be used to train people for jobs in manufacturing, healthcare, information technology, and several other industries. Career counseling and advising will also be offered. A new vaccine claims to be 90% effective in preventing the coronavirus. Now Pfizer is just waiting on the FDA to approve it. And once it is approved, the first people to get vaccinated will undergo extra safety tracking. And that way the government can watch for any side effects that didn't come up in the study. We are starting off on a chilly note. Parts of the valley down in the 30s this morning for the first time since last winter. So you probably want to coat if you're heading outside. By the afternoon, though, we're back in the mid and the upper 50s. That is still quite cool uh, for this time of November. Wednesday, Veterans Day, a high of 61. Mid-60s, Thursday through Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. They have a couple of breezes on Friday, a few more clouds. But all in all, pretty smooth sailing weather-wise this week. And that was your 13 Action News update. You can find more on our website, ktnv.com, and our free mobile app.